So today, today is Wednesday, March the 8th, and I haven't really done much of an update since I last like spoke to you guys about what was going on. Um, so I got my husband moved. He's in uh, Montgomery at his new job. I'm here all alone, all by myself, and I'm supposed to be packing, but that has not happened yet, as of yet. I'm actually off work tomorrow, so I'm going to work on that some. I've been experimenting with my prints. I hope you can see them. Um, trying to get them to look just right. I have another one. Oh. The other one is in the frame. <laughs> Sitting here looking for the other print. The uh, photo that I posted on Instagram of the one that's framed is actually um, a framed print. So, there's that. Son of a bitch. You guys, this MacBook, which isn't really even mine, it's my husband, is dying a slow and miserable fucking death. And I really want um, an all-in-one. You know, so you can feel the power. But this one is just fucking dying. And it doesn't even matter because, like, I try and keep everything of all of my videos and stuff and my uh, sound files from the podcast, which takes up a fuck ton of space. I try to keep it on an external hard drive. But it still, it still runs really, really fucking slow. But yeah, project for tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm off work. I need to start packing some. So I plan on packing up some of my books. Can you see my books? Can you see the wide array of shit that I have piled up behind me? So while I start packing those up, maybe I'll set a few aside and kind of give you guys a tour of what I have since I have to be putting them up anyways. So I'm doing that and I think I'm going to pack up my DVDs tomorrow too because that'll be easy stuff that I don't really need. All the hard stuff is going to be the large amount of art supplies that I own. I'm pretty sure everything that we own that we're moving is all mine. My husband has like camping gear and that's kind of his hobby that he does. But uh, he's already packed all of his stuff as far as that goes. So everything else that's left is pretty much all of my shit, which is a lot. I have a lot of shit. And like large like furniture type items, which we don't have many of those. We have like a couch, we have my desk, uh, a few bookcases. Uh, we don't even have a bed frame. We just, our bed sleeps better on the floor. Like I have a really, I do have a really nice bed frame, but I fucking hate it. And I'd rather put my bed on the floor, like, you know, because it sleeps better. It's so much more supported. And then just like all of my witchy stuff, which is... A lot of stuff but I do have a trunk that has just like some blankets and stuff like that in it so I think I'm gonna try and just pack all my witchy stuff into that and I think it'll be a lot easier to transport it even like leave some of the blankets in it so it doesn't get broken um, and yeah everything else is art supplies like little teeny tiny pieces which I have like Tupperware storage for right now but like those are falling apart so I really need to get like actual like drawers to put stuff in but I don't own those yet so I'm thinking about just boxing it up and then just leaving fucking everything boxed up until I can actually buy some drawers to put it in whenever we get our new uh, house or rental or whatever whatever it is we'd be doing so but in the meantime I'm looking forward to the giveaway uh, being over with so you guys still have a couple days if this video is up by them it's being announced on <sighs> man one thing I'm not gonna miss sorry I got it rudely interrupted and that's one thing I'm not gonna miss is fucking dealing with the public and like them having my phone number and everything like I love I really love a lot of my clients and like I'm friends with them but like goddamn stop texting me when I'm not at work I'm such a hermit and like the more I worked in the public like the less I wanted to be around people like I would be perfectly happy sitting here all day long every single day by myself talking to myself like as long as I get to see my husband sometimes I'm gonna be so happy like thank you dear Jesus I just want to sit here and make my little videos and like do my little artwork and talk to you guys and hopefully be able to make some type of money doing this we shall see. 
I fully understand why people become agoraphobic, though. Fuck. Anyways, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, I was talking about the giveaway. I'm excited about that. I am uh, kind of getting prepared for that in terms of uh, working out how the prints are going to look. They're going to be not too bad. I think they're going to be pretty good. I'm going to be working on my coloring sheet for April, my April uh, patrons. I want to make sure I have that ready and scheduled to release on the 1st of April because I'll be, that's when I'm going to be transitioning. I'm going to be leaving. So, oh, I don't even think I've told you guys. So my last day at work is the 24th. That's the last day I had to go to my job and I get to say goodbye to everybody and it's been really fucking sad. It's been awful been really sad that weekend the 24th is a Friday and then I get to leave that day and we're going to Jason's gonna come home uh, that evening and we're gonna finish packing up like everything we're gonna have everything packed and just ready to be moved and we're gonna leave it all here because we don't have a space yet or as of right now we don't maybe maybe I'll find something so we can just move right the fuck into it I don't know but as of right now we'll pack it all up and then I'll go up there that weekend and now I'm not gonna have hardly any fucking internet they have the place we're staying they have wi-fi but it's like three megabits per second and like everybody shares it so basically there's no wi-fi pretty much like sometimes you can look at it but like at nighttime when everybody's home there's no there's no nothing nothing so there definitely won't be any video uploads unless i go somewhere to like a starbucks to like upload my little videos or something like that but that probably won't happen either because we only have one vehicle oh the struggles of life and I'm fortunate enough to not have to struggle too hard. Like, I feel like I've really fucking struggled. But I know that there are people that have it much, much worse. And I cannot imagine. I cannot. I just can't even. I can't even. So, kudos to anybody who is, you know, making that upward climb. I've been there. You can do it. <laughs>